This chapter is about RACI, responsibility, accountability, consultation and information. A management tool which is extremely useful as an enabler in deciding who does what at different hierarchies of decision making activities. Dealing with complex transformational change requires clear thought processes, structures, work and project streams and accountability from the outset. Each change team needs to be empowered to make appropriate decisions so that the team can self-regulate without needing to refer to others continuously while delivering effective, actionable results. In large-scale transformation programs, it is almost impossible to monitor each aspect in detail. Trying to do so can itself inhibit the process of change. Keeping records takes time and presents a picture that seldom reflects what is actually happening. In fact, detailed monitoring of any complex change from the top down puts the focus of motivation into monitoring away and away from creating momentum needed for change. I'd like to explain what the acronym RACI stands for. R is the responsibility role, the role that is allocated to those who have to do the work, that is, those who add value to the delivery. In RACI, one or more people can be assigned to delivery. The accountability role is assigned to the people or person who is accountable for the ultimate outcome of the work. This person whose neck is on the line may also have responsibility for all or some parts of the work. Experience shows that people welcome accountability if they feel they have the tools to succeed. The consultation role is for those who need to be consulted as part of the activity. One thing that makes organizations weak is the ability to recognize when necessary to consult an external expert or an internal expert without giving away the responsibility for delivery. The information role identifies individuals who need to be informed after a decision or action is taken. This information uh, is mainly for people who are affected by the change and it is critical in transformation. Clarity on who does what doesn't need to, and who doesn't need to be informed is essential to prevent over, over communication. A single way of communication, e.g. mail shots, may appear to be a good strategy but, but might not work. So what RACI does is allows different ways of communicating to different stakeholders.